To access the retirement application portal, visit LASERS website at www.lasers.org. Welcome to the LASERS Retirement Application Portal. LASERS Retirement Application Portal is a new system separate from your MyLASERS account. This system allows you to input your information, upload your required documents, and submit your retirement application entirely online. LASER's Retirement Application Portal is designed to help members through the retirement process and includes links to informational videos on YouTube and other useful links to help complete your application. The portal is best viewed in your web browser on a desktop or laptop PC rather than a mobile device. To benefit fully from the retirement portal, you should have a retirement benefit estimate handy. Contact LASERS 90 days prior to your retirement effective date to allow staff time to provide one. You should also access the Retirement Decision Sheet. This form is printable, but the digital form has links to informational videos on YouTube intended to help explain the retirement process. The Decision Sheet helps you use information on your retirement benefit estimate to help you make decisions about your benefits. You can use this sheet to familiarize yourself with the decisions you'll make in the retirement process and make note of your choices prior to making your official selection in the retirement portal. Both your retirement decision sheet and your retirement benefit estimate are valuable tools to help you in filling out your retirement application and making retirement decisions. So keep them nearby as you go through the portal. Click the button to reach the login page where you can log into your account or create your account if this is your first time accessing the portal. To create your account, click the Sign Up Now link below the Sign In button. During the process of creating your account, you'll need to verify your email address. When signing up, keep in mind that Lacers recommends using a personal email and not your work email address. Enter your email address in the field and click the Send Verification Code button. Open your email and check for the verification code. It will come from LASERS via Microsoft. You'll find a six-digit verification code, which you'll then enter in the LASERS Retirement Portal. Once you've entered your code, click the Verify Code button to verify the address. Next, create your password. It must contain a combination of upper and lowercase letters, a number, and a symbol. Enter your first and last name, your zip code, and phone number. Finally, click the Create button to create the account. Once the account has been created, you'll be taken straight into the portal. Once you are in the portal, you will see that your account has your name and information. On the upper right corner, you'll notice a circular icon, and you can click this icon to log out of the portal from any area. Below that, you will see a button to create a new application. Click the button labeled Create New Application to start your retirement application process. Let's review the first application screen called Tell Us About Yourself. Every application starts on the Personal Info page. To the left, you'll see the list of sections you'll need to complete in order to submit your retirement application. Each section will have questions to be answered, information to be entered, or documents to be submitted. Once each section is complete, the plus sign will change to a check mark. You can also return to any of these pages to add or change information prior to submitting your application. Please read the Before You Start section before filling out information in the application. The information and video links will help guide you in making your retirement decisions and the retirement process. Take note of the items in the Required Documents section. In order to help you complete your application more quickly, you should have your required documents scanned and saved to your computer for easy access so they are ready to upload to the portal when they are requested. Tips for completing your application. For security, the portal will automatically log you out after a long period of inactivity. A pop-up will appear if you've been inactive and will prompt you to click continue to keep working in the portal or log out to end your session. 
One benefit of this online portal is that your progress can be saved so you can return to it later. Make sure to save your information to the portal as you progress. To save the information on any page, scroll to the bottom of the page and click the Next Section button. This will save your information and allow you to return at a later time. If you do not complete all the information on a given page, you will receive a pop-up that notifies you the section is incomplete and will ask if you'd like to leave the page and save your progress for later or stay on the current page and continue working. Required information will have a red asterisk and the text answer is required will appear if you have missed a required question. Throughout the application, there will be documents that you will need to download, fill out, and upload back to the portal. Some of these include the Form W-9 and the Health Enrollment Forms, for example. All of these documents will require your signature. Make sure to sign and date these forms before uploading them. Missing signatures can cause a delay in your retirement application processing. When entering dates into date fields, click the calendar icon to use the calendar dropdown to select your date, or enter the numbers into the field separated by slashes. To save the date entered, remember to press the Enter key. Pressing any other key may cause the cursor to leave that text field and erase your input. When filling out your beneficiary information, Percentages will display at the top of the page. Fill in your beneficiary information and make sure to assign them a percentage for benefits. And remember that the total must equal 100%. You have the option of designating both primary and secondary beneficiaries, and the percentages will display for each to ensure that they reach 100%. It's important to note that your application is not considered submitted until you have entered all your information, uploaded all your documents, signed the application, and clicked the Submit Application button on the final page of the portal. Remember, your application must be submitted within 30 to 60 days prior to your retirement effective date. You may receive an error if you submit your application and you have entered a date outside of the filing period. Once you have completed your application and all the pages are checked, you will be able to submit your application on the final page. Please take the time to review your information and confirm all your application entries before submitting. Information discrepancies can cause a delay in processing your application and after the application is submitted, you will no longer be able to modify any information. Once you're satisfied that all your information is correct, submit your application. After your application is submitted, LACER staff will begin to process your retirement. You will be able to log into your account on the retirement portal and see information including which LACER staff is assigned to your case and what step of the process your application is in. If you have questions or need assistance with the retirement application portal, email lacers.services at lacers.org or call the Member Service Center at 1-800-779-8328.